concern. I'm filling out paperwork for tomorrow and I can't find a pen because I just, I have not seen a pen, a pencil, an eraser, a paper clip, like nothing related to school in the cool like four months. I just don't know where everything went. And I doubt my backpack has any because when I was at school, I never found a pencil, let alone a pen. This one never had ink. I always struggled with it at school. What the heck? Yeah, none of these have ink. I think we're gonna have to take the L here. I found some scissors though, and I've been needing some. I'm gonna leave those there. Yes! I found some. I think these are like from three years ago. If you haven't seen my room decoration video, you should. It's a good one. Let's get started. It's 9.23 p.m. Probably not a good time to start off filling out this paperwork because it's pretty big. That's what she said. <laughs> Am I the only one who can't open envelopes? Like I swear I've never opened an envelope successfully to where this doesn't happen. And my mom does it like it's nothing. I'm like, from what I remember past years, literally like, this is the only thing that we turn in and this is the like emergency card. First day of schools are always filled with excitement. Welcome to 2020 school year. First day of school are always filled with excitement and anticipation with coronavirus challenges and a new hybrid instructional model slash schedule. We have never experienced a start of school quite like this. In June, we didn't open schools, over 80% of students, they don't desire the hyperbaric method, blah, 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 as a result, blah, 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 blah. Can y'all believe I'm a senior? Because I still can't believe that. Like, I really cannot believe I'm a senior. Hashtag senior year ruined, hashtag no football games, hashtag no first day of senior year. So I'm 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. Because it's cruise and I'm cuevas. Please bring any textbooks slash library books. Yeah, I know. We have so many of those. I still have my calculator, like, the school really thought we were gonna go back. Whatever. Third, ID pic. I was not aware we were gonna be taking ID pictures. Students will provide a lanyard with an ID badge on the first day that the student reports to campus, either August 6th or the 7th. Well, that didn't age well. I think they made these packets before we found out we weren't gonna go back to school because by the way, we're not going back to school. So I think they made those before. Students are not allowed in the parking lot to sit in a car? The disrespect, I'm totally not buying that. My car is my chill spot. All right, whatever, dress code. All right, so I finished the year's worth of paperwork I had, and also on the paper it said that we had to take back like four forms. I only got three in my mail, so I don't know where the heck I'm supposed to get the last one at, but I'm just not gonna take it and be like, y'all didn't give it to me. English, physics, math, History, it's another English book we got. The problem is, here's the problem. I can't find my black book, which was supposed to be for English, like my black textbook that is like for my English class, like my English textbook. So I can't find it anywhere. And that thing costs like $100. So, many times, so basically I'm just searching for my books now so I can be ready for tomorrow because they want you to turn in all your textbooks and your calculator. We're ready. This is the most senior activity I'm going to have probably. Off of you guys in the morning, we're looking for my textbook because I'm not about to pay $100 for that textbook. I can't wake up. Like my eyes don't want to open. <sighs> <laughs> it is currently 7:12. I need to leave my house by like 8 because I already know there's gonna be a huge line And I want to stop at Starbucks. I'm gonna go use the restroom I'm gonna brush my teeth and I'm gonna wash my face and I'll be back All right, I feel so much better now now I'm just gonna get ready and I'm like I feel like I have that feel You know like I know for a fact I'm gonna see people from school and I don't know if like I'm I don't know. We're gonna see how this goes. All right, what are we doing? What are we doing? Are we doing light makeup? Are we doing bold makeup? Okay, I definitely don't want to do bold makeup. It is not the move. But I definitely do think I should at least do my eyebrows for my picture because last year for junior year, I did my eyebrows. So it's gonna look weird if I don't do my eyebrows for senior year. But also, since you guys hate my eyebrows, you made me think my eyebrows are really trash. And if I look back at my eyebrows in like five years and I really don't like them, I'm gonna be really upset. But then again, it's just high school, so. This is the finished product. I ended up just doing my makeup as well because, you guys want another time? 7.57, which means I have three minutes exactly to put on my clothes because I need to like load. Look at how bad my eyelashes look because my curler broke down. Like it. Like, there's no top part. Like, I don't even know. It flew out. Oh, look. My mom's calling me. Probably to tell me to hurry up. Hi, Mom. All right. I just finished putting on my clothes. Let me show you guys the fit on the mirror. So, the top, you guys have seen it. And then my jeans are from Hollister. Yeah, all my jeans are from Hollister. It's high-waisted, advanced stretch, leggings, jean leggings. And my vans are just, like, slip-on. 
It's a bomb band. So I wore these like, these are ultra high rise actually. And I wore them so there would be like a smaller gap. So I just for sure would not get dress coded. All right, I'm gonna go get my mom a coffee because she's like doing the yard outside. So I'm gonna get her a coffee. I'm gonna go to the store, get her coffee, bring her back. And then we're gonna go to orientation. I need to take these heavy ass books. Let's see. Aha! I knew there was something. Okay, I think that's it. All right, so now we gotta load these heavy ass books into my car. Great! Okay, I'll be right back. All right, let's go. Oh, that's some. Oh my god, it is so hot. That's harsh ass sun. I ended up just leaving my books right there with my mom, and I'm gonna go get her a coffee. And then on my way back, she says she'll load them in the trunk for me. My car is parked across the street. Because my mom's doing the yard, so I am not ready to go to school. I'm really not. Even if it's just orientation, I, the vibes, you know, the vibes are just not it. All right, just got here to 7-Eleven. For some reason, my mom likes them from here. It's like the French vanilla she likes. So I'm going to get in there, and then we are going to go to Starbucks because my... It's 8.17, so I still have time to like go to Starbucks and then go to my school. So after this, we're going to take the coffee, and then we're going to Starbucks. Dang, the lighting... The lighting's not bad here, not gonna cap. I just got here to live at the house and my mom is loading in my books to my trunk. All right, I'm at Starbucks and I'm just kind of waiting now. I swear I thought it was close because I saw no one here. So I like parked to see if a car could go in front of me and they could, so then I went, but another car ended up going in front of me. So now two cars are in front of me. Yeah. <laughs> Iced coffee with four pumps of white mocha and sweet cream. Okay. Grande. So I just got out of Starbucks. I'm literally balancing you guys on just my car. Here's my Starbucks drink. Fire. So now we're basically gonna come to school. And my school's like literally two minutes away from here, so. Oh my. There is so many people here. Stay in the vehicle, make sure you wear a mask at all times, follow the traffic all the way down. Okay, thank you. thank you. Okay, so I don't know what track they're talking about. Like, I don't see anyone following a track. I'm so blessed to be able to have a car because, like, for the people who don't have a car, have to, like, go on foot. It's really hot outside, and they have to interact more with people. Now that I'm at school, I have more mixed feelings, you see. Like, let me just explain really quickly. Let me show you, well, let me show you guys, like, this, I'm waiting right here and then the line goes that way and then over there there's like the book stuff and then the pictures are like behind me but okay so let me just explain something real quick in theory I would be very sad extremely sad actually I am sad that I'm not gonna get like a first day of senior year or whatever because obviously like that's everyone wants to have that right at the same time it's like if like being here at school just reminds me of like waking up early, going to classes, like having to do this and that, and the pros of being at home and being able to film and waking up late, they just overrule the cons of like not having a first day of senior year. I don't know. Maybe other seniors will think differently, but oh, all my white mocha is down here. This is gonna take forever. There's a, oh my God. Cause like we're not even moving. All right. So station one is my paperwork. So let me just make sure everything is good. My friend saw me from the front. I think it's a requirement for you to get a Chromebook, actually. I thought at the beginning, I thought they said something about it being... Like, if you wanted to get one, but I'm pretty sure it's a requirement. I just sit back and observe. So I'm gonna just set you guys down and so you guys can hear, like, the whole conversation. I'm gonna turn my viewfinder back. Your paperwork, please. Oh. And then they're gonna come take your book. My... Okay, I'll get them out of the trunk. Okay, okay, no problem. Okay, just watch me because I'm gonna give you some more paperwork, okay? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna get off to get my book. <gasps> I kind of want you guys to get the full experience with me, but I really don't want them to see my camera because it's gonna be so embarrassing. This is to put your phone number, so I don't know if I should put. I don't even have a pencil. Okay, can I get the half sheet of paper from you? That one right there. Thank you. Thank you. All right, you can head to the next station now. Have a great day. All right, you too. All right, so we're on picture station. Basically, I took my picture and everyone stared at me and it was the most embarrassing. How the hell am I supposed to get out of here? So you know how I was telling you guys I didn't know where to go through and no one was saying anything. Like, no security guard was saying where to go through. Like, no one cared. So obviously, I went through the wrong way and everybody, like, behind me also went through there because 
the place where you were supposed to go out through it had a bunch of cones so no one knew if that was like the place to go through so everyone was like also coming my way and the car in front of me also went through that way and the security was like no 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 like wrong way wrong way you guys shouldn't be following each other i was like well if maybe someone would have said something the car in front of me wouldn't have gone that way i wouldn't have gone that way and everybody behind me wouldn't have gone that way but now we're going home um hopefully my picture came out good because that was the most embarrassing thing ever oh my god all right so i got home from my orientation thing so basically they did give us chromebooks and i don't think it was mandatory because the person's like oh you're getting a chromebook right and then but he already has a chromebook in his hand so i was like sure um so they gave us the chromebooks right here they're just kind of like hold up they're, they're literally just, and it says like chrome on this side. And my schedule, I'm gonna clean my room because it's starting to get dirty and if I let my room get dirty, it's gonna get to a point where I just, it's gonna be so dirty to where I don't wanna clean it anymore. So I'm gonna clean like my entire room because my vanity, uh, sis, yeah. All right, so basically I have not cleaned my room, like at all, because something ended up happening, um, Ricardo ended up testing positive for coronavirus, which kind of threw a curveball at my whole day right now because I could potentially have coronavirus, but I haven't been close to Edith, Ricardo, or Nelly for the past like week. So I could be in the clear. I just don't really feel like cleaning anymore. I was gonna clean my room, but I don't really feel like doing that anymore. So I think I'm just gonna lay down and play Minecraft. Do you wanna see my painting? <laughs> Painted. <laughs> I painted yesterday. Uh, good night. Um, I literally, I fell asleep, like, uh, let me show you guys what time it is. It's 9.09 p.m. right now. I went to sleep at like 5, and I woke up around 5 minutes ago. Makeup and all, clothes and all. Well, actually, this shirt was the one, like, I went to school with, but, like, I changed shorts because jeans are uncomfortable. But this is how I fell asleep. <sighs> That's the that's the problem with going to sleep at like 1 in the morning and having to wake up at 7 to go to your senior year orientation. Also, a little update on the coronavirus thing. I feel fine. I feel good. I don't like, I I feel like every other day. Dang, this one comes from far away. Oh my god. These are cases. That's cute. This one's really nice. Oh wait, there's three. Hold up, there's three. I didn't know there was three. Okay, am I the only one really bad at doing this? Like, you're supposed to rip, bruh. Oh, this is cute. It's kind of like a tie-dye collage. Huh, that's cute. This is their information in case you guys are interested in any of the cases. This is their Instagram right here. Uh, yeah, I was eating hot Cheetos. You can, yeah. Look how cute this packaging is. So cute. <laughs> this is definitely a small business because small businesses will take the time to doing something like this, which is so cute. The Instagram is Paulette's Boutique, I think that's how you say it. Okay, so this is a bracelet. This is a shirt, I believe. Oh, this is cute. It's like a crown and it has like leopard. This is cute because I could just like tie it right here. Oh, that's cute. And this one is an off the shoulder top, I believe. Oh yeah, it is. It's an off the shoulder top. That's so cute. <laughs> okay, and I have one other package that I received like a couple days ago, but I didn't want to like open it without showing you guys. This is their business card. They're like earrings, like jewels. These are the earrings right here. So that's sweet, I believe. And this is the second one. Oh my god, these are little gummy bears. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, these are little leaves with like a little jewel in the center. So this is the last one. There are these lollipops. These are the last ones. Right? These are so cute. Um. Oh, also I didn't tell you guys what classes I got, but I got calculus, AP, virtual enterprises, which I'm trying to drop that class. I just, like I'm not gonna go back to school anyways. I the least amount of classes I have, like I don't need it. So. Uh, Psychology AP, Economics 1, and English Lit AP. I know for a fact they're not trying to make me start school at 7.45. That's my senior year orientation. <laughs> Alright, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!